Becoming a sister or a nun, devoting yourself to religious life isn't easy. But I never realized just how much time it takes from joining a congregation to coming out the other side as a sister. Well, nearly 10 to 12 years, in case you're wondering. The path of religious life or formation is a life devoted to Christ. We had a glimpse of it when we visited two congregations in Kerala. The congregation of the Sisters of St. Martha in Trishur, part of the Siro Malabar Church, and the congregation of the Daughters of Mary in Tiruvananthapuram, part of the Siro Malankara Church. The sisters here were so honest about their faith, something that's close to my heart. I always like to explore what an individual's faith means to them, simply because it's something special to each one of us. Every single one of us has experienced faith differently. The sisters at both these congregations have what can only be described as an unshakable, absolute trust in Christ, in his sacred heart. Let me tell you a simple story. We met Sister Susanna, a junior sister. She's from Tamil Nadu, but spending a year in Kerala. She said whenever she feels like eating ice cream or having a chocolate, she asks Christ. In convents usually, life is simple and meager. But whenever Sister Susanna asks for a sweet treat, she said she somehow gets it. Either a visitor comes bearing chocolates, or sisters who may have ventured outside come back with ice cream. I was so touched by Sister Susanna's innocence and the trust she has that if she asks with a pure and prayerful heart, she will get. On a more practical note, Convents in Kerala have seen the number of young women wanting to be sisters decline. This is mainly due to nuclear families where couples choose not to have more than two children. It's also because of the phenomenal growth of technology and social media. Young people in Kerala these days like to spend their time on smartphones rather than going to church or spending time with family or praying or reading the Bible. The road ahead is challenging. But as Sister Susanna said, for things to fall into place, for everything to work out, we need to have a stable relationship with Christ. He never lets us down. We just have to believe.